Pixels. I'm getting ready to go get my betas done. Um, I'm currently a hot mess. I'm nervous. I'm scared. I'm scared my numbers aren't doubling. Miss Margie told me to stop taking the test because I found out way too early that they're still going to be super light. And just to watch my HCG. Um, beta HCG levels. Quit worrying about them tests. And I didn't start my progesterone last night because I was thinking that I would get my blood work done one more time. And a bunch of ladies and other groups that I'm in kind of scared me about birth defects and side effects of the medicine. And I honestly wanted to make sure my numbers were doubling instead of getting on the pr prometrium and prolonging this pregnancy if it's not going to be viable. So, she said to just wait until I check my numbers today. I'm going. Um, I gotta be there at 12. And we're gonna check those and then we will go from there. About if the numbers doubled, I should get them back within an hour. If my beta's doubled, then tonight I will start the progesterone. If it is not, then I will see my doctor on Thursday and we will determine um, if this is a viable pregnancy or not or where it's headed. And I guess I'll get my levels done again there. But I just wanted to update you guys a little bit on what was going on and let you guys know that a little bit of information and if you will pray that my levels doubled um, because I will so seriously be heartbroken if this is a chemical pregnancy um, we done and my my young, oldest son found out who told my oldest I mean my oldest son found out who told my middle who told um, his grandmother, he had overheard us talking when I didn't think he was listening. So, um, they know. I, I just, I just don't want, I'm just praying, I'm giving it to the Lord that the numbers are going to rise, that it's going to be in the correct spot, and that we are going to have a thriving um, pregnancy. Even Miss Margie said, I found out way before I should have ever found out. And that's the bad thing about testing so early. Is finding out so early. And then that makes you I don't know, worry more. Or if it is a chemical pregnancy back in the day, people used to not test so early so they wouldn't find out so, so early until they were further along. And most of the time, they never knew if they had a chemical pregnancy at all because they didn't find out. Um, like I said, if you guys will just shoot me up a quick prayer that everything is going to be okay. And in the right spot. And that if it's the Lord's will, that my numbers will be rose. Or rising, not rose. Um, or at least double. And I will update you more tomorrow. Um, when I get done with my doctor's appointment. I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. I'm literally... So nervous. Uh, have a great day. 
Hey ladies, I was just going to hop on here real quick and um, give you a small update. My levels did not double yesterday from, let's see, um, Monday to Wednesday. It only went up from 11 to a 15, but they also had a student um, that drew my blood and handled it and... Um, I, I'm not very, um, what would the word be, trusting in that result. Uh, I have another result for Friday. So I went Monday, and Wednesday was yesterday's result was a 15. Uh, Monday's was 11, and then we'll do Friday's. I have a... OB appointment today so we'll know exactly how far along I am and what to do. I started my progesterone last night and that's all I got right now. I will be headed to my appointment at 12.45 today and I will update you after we get done there. So, so far my betas, um, 7 DPO were less than one, 10 DPO were three, um, 13 DPO were HCG was 11, um, and 15 DPO it was a 15. So that is where my levels are.